once again welcome to Adiotech. In today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to use the zoom effect in Adobe Premiere Pro. Let's say, for instance, you have a video and you want to lay or place emphasis on portion of your video by just zooming on that portion of that video. This effect can work on that. So let's assume we have this login page, a WordPress login page, and want to zoom in by enlarging it for people to see clearly. Let's say you want to create something like this. We want to be able to zoom in and enlarge that portion of the video. We can use this property to do that. So we're going to learn how to do that using Adobe Premiere Pro. If you, I'm using the 2019, 2020 version. It doesn't really matter if you use any of the most recent version. It's still going to work for you. So let's see how we can create this in just some few minutes. Timeline, and then I want to zoom in on any part of this video. And we're going to use that effect to do that. Okay. So we have our effect control, which is going to help us to scale on that part of our video. So I select my video on my timeline. Before we can scale on that video, we need to place what we call the anchor point. We need to know where our anchor point is. So this anchor point, wherever we place the anchor point, we can zoom in on that part of our video. Okay. So if I select this anchor point right now, you can see this is my anchor point placed somewhere here. So even me, even if I want to zoom to this video right now, this part of the video will be zoomed in on. But I don't want to zoom in. Let's say we want to focus on this. So let's say we want to zoom in on the red button over here. We just have to move our anchor point there. Place our anchor point on that. And then to zoom in on that portion of our video, we just have to add a scale to that place. Just click and then add a scale over there. So with our anchor point placed over there, you cannot increase the scaling from the from 100% to the right. You drag on that and you can see that we've been able to zoom in on that portion of our video. In order to reset and bring your video to the original state, let's say we play this video to this stage and then we want to reset it back to its normal stage. You can just go and then, first you can hold that video for us some time. Let's say you want to hold the play and then explain this portion of the video before you scale it back to its normal stage you can click on that so we can maintain this within this particular range we are going to maintain this scaling and then we want to reverse it we can move it forward a bit and then we can use the reset so we have the reset parameter and this when you click on this it's going to bring this video back to its normal stage so when i click on this it's going to set the video back to this stage so when you come back you realize our video has been scaled to this point and then when we get to this stage our video should be at least restore back to its normal size so basically this is how to add a effect control basically this is how to add a zoom effect control in adobe premiere remember to subscribe to this channel because i'm going to add in more amazing video i'll be doing more interesting videos on adobe after effect adobe premiere pro photoshop and the rest so you need to subscribe so that you don't miss any of this so you need to subscribe so that you don't miss any of these videos. So you can add this kind of zoom effect to any video at all that you are creating. So I most of the time use this to explain my videos as well. Focus on portion that I want to zoom in on. I'm going to explain details about Adobe effects, some strategy, Adobe Premiere Pro, and the rest. So subscribe so that you don't miss any of that video. Thank you so much for enjoying this short tutorial. Bye bye.